Do I have a background in art? The smallest thing I ever painted was a house. My name is uh, Bill Lutz, and I'm here just because I'm a senior citizen and kind of bored at home and looking for something to do. Uh, my name is Holly Ann Shank, and I am teaching Discover Painting for the Continuing Education for the Kansas City Art Institute. Actually, what's wonderful about the Kansas City Art Institute's Continuing Education program is that it is for everybody. You can have um, people that have never ever picked up a paintbrush before, and I, in the same class as people that actually sell their artwork. And so we try to really work with people and say what do they want to learn and what are they trying to accomplish and make everything for everybody. With regard to an art background, I am not any way, shape, or form an artist. And if you don't have an art background, this is easy. This is Art 101. The classes here are based on, on what you're able to do. They show you techniques. They help you. They don't expect you to be an artist. They just want to help you and to express yourself so you have a more fulfilled life. Um, we kind of work with the idea that everybody's handwriting is different, so everybody's artwork is going to be different too. So people work at different paces, people have different goals. Some people are just trying to have a hobby and escape from the usual drudgery of the world. And other people are trying to capitalize on the expertise of the Art Institute and say, what can they do to make their products better for sale? No one should be apprehensive about taking any type of an art class because in art there is never a wrong. There is only a right. Try it. Just try it.